them endoscopy so okay now but I say five of them within a few months and I spent more time with that camera down throat than out on bike with this camera maybe I should do a vlog from inside my, my stomach with the camera going down That'd be a first, wouldn't it? <laughs> Bloody hell, can you imagine that? I keep saying I want to do something different, something different from what everyone else does. Uh, sometimes it can get a bit bored in these vlogs. Everyone seems to be doing the same thing. So I could start with. Right, I'm getting in here now. Swallow. Fucking swallow. Have you ever tried swallowing one of them cameras? But the uh, fourth, fourth one I had, I just couldn't get the camera down there. Well, five attempts it took to get the camera down, actually down the throat. One time I got, did swallow it, and felt it at the back of my throat, and it, it was stuck. Couldn't get the bloody camera out, so I felt as though I was going to bloody die there and then on the table. Sick of having cameras down my throat and little bits taken off of me. Could definitely do a vlog on one of them cameras. Here we are going down throat, going down this tunnel. Get down your esophagus. Get to the top of your gullet and okay now what's that? We've got a blockage there. Oh that looks nasty does that? What the fuck is that? I tell you what, we'll push by it and we'll Clip a piece off the here and piece off there. Let's do some biopsies on it. We'll have a look at that. We'll go down here. We'll another look down there. What's that? That looks a bit nasty. We'll take a piece, piece off there. And come back up. Right. We'll see you again in another couple of weeks' time. We'll come back down again. Let's do another fucking blood down your throat. <laughs> I don't know. Some people have said to me, you know, that uh, I should sue them for uh, telling, telling me and the wife that I'd got cancer and they were 99% sure it was cancer. But, yeah, I mean, doctors make mistakes and what nicer mistake could I possibly ever make in uh, diagnosing you wrong, saying that you've got cancer? And then finding out after tests and that that it isn't actually cancer. So I'm chuffed a bit, so I'm not bloody uh, putting any claims against the doctor at hospitals or anything. So I'm just happy to be alive. That's how you should look at it. Your health is more important than anything in the world, more important than any possessions, any money. I mean, luckily enough, I'm blessed with, uh, I'm not well off, like, but um, I'm better than a lot of people. There's people out there that I can't afford a car now, can't afford a motorbike. Even struggle bloody getting food down them for weeks. So I thank my blessings that everything is all right. And I have got my health. And I hope all of you appreciate your health and look after yourselves, don't abuse it. I did abuse it a bit and uh, some of these problems that I have has been caused by too much drinking. Which I know I shouldn't have done but uh, I just had that many get togethers coming up week after, weekend after a weekend. What with birthdays, bloody weddings, reunions and going out with my mate, I was just doing too many of them, you know what I mean, so... Right, that's the end of this vlog. Hopefully, you're all going to stay safe. And more than anything, keep healthy. I'll see you in the next one.